The election, as it was, finally in the rearview mirror, along with school holidays, there is the rare feeling of an uninterrupted run from here to summer. And there's no question that sellers feel it too and are responding. We have jumped out of the blocks with a greater selection of properties than we have had in quite some time. On a personal note, it's more than a little satisfying to have done so at a time where there is still a great shortage overall, but I have no doubt that a solid wave of properties is coming in the broader market as well. Said it before, saying it again, if you are selling this year, the sooner the better. August is already closed, we are listing for September now. Thought we'd talk about something completely different this month, the case of Airbnb versus the normal avenue. We've picked up numerous clients switching back from the attempt. The reality is that the Airbnb route is hugely labour intensive. The continuous pursuit of tenants coming and going daily and weekly, linen changes, furniture upkeep, cleaning and overall maintenance, just constant work. While the returns can be higher, higher vacancy rates negate much of that advantage and clients are left wondering if the difference is really worth their time and effort. One of the advantages of long-term rentals is the relatively passive aspect. You really can sit back and forget if you so choose, or be as involved as you have the time and desire for when under the care and guidance of a professional property manager. We look forward to discussing what this market may mean for you anytime.